Hey everybody, this is Janelle Pika from Janelle Pika's Primal Strength Training. I'm here at Pittsburgh Kettlebells today shooting this video, and today I want to talk about the ascending and descending kettlebell goblet squat and curl ladder, okay? This is something that I've learned from um, courses that I've taken through the RKC uh, strength training system and also the Strong First strength training system. Um, if you are not familiar with those two um, kettlebell organizations, please go to dragonlord.com or strongfirst.com, um, and you will find out how you can find, um, become a certified instructor with either one of those um, organizations, okay? I learned this particular routine from one of my um, first ever uh, courses that I were taught here in Pittsburgh um, under Strong First, and um, I'm gonna show you what this looks like today. Um, before I get into the actual technique of what we're about to do, is I recommend going light with your kettlebell training on this, folks. Okay, I've got a 12 kilo here due to the sheer volume of what we're about to get done. Ladies, I don't recommend going beyond 12 kilos. Stay between 10 or 12 as we go through this. Guys, I recommend no heavier than a 20 kilo just for a lot of uh, the curling work you're going to get with your arms. Okay, but ballpark for you, for, for the males on this one, would be probably about 16 kilos. Okay, no joke. All right. To start, you are going to begin with one goblet squat, and then you are going to perform 10 arm curls with the bell at your center at the bottom of your squat. So here's what that's gonna look like. Goblet squat, down, perform 10 curls. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hut, back up. You'll then do two, Goblet squats. The second one, you're going to do nine curls. Two, three, four, five, whoo, six, seven, eight, nine, Hut, back at the top of your squat, okay? You're going to go the whole ways up to ten squats and the whole ways down to one bicep curl, okay? As you can see, that is precisely why I want you guys on very light weights for this, okay? Recommendation two, on your curls at the bottom, okay, do not let the bell hit the floor entirely, okay? Keep that leverage really well. That way you don't actually drop your bell, okay, uh, mid-set and stuff like that, okay? Um, if you have any questions about um, this particular routine or anything else under um, our online poetry form, you can email me at Janelle at JanellePika.com. Thank you very much for taking a look at this video. We'll see you on the next one. Press on.